This is a Ford Ranger with one of these camping units on the top. Now, a Ford Ranger is around what? Nearly 50,000 euros. Uh, the whole thing together, you're probably looking around 75,000 euros, something like that. Uh, that's a, an approximation. It's not an offer, so if you're really interested, you'd have to find out for yourselves. And it depends how many additional features you request. Now, the advantage of a thing like this is it does have the, some of the advantages of a car and um, the living accommodation is small, but it's usually quite um, effective the way it's done. Now, in some vehicles, you can actually drive it away. You can just leave your camping pod somewhere and then be off. Other vehicles, it's actually welded onto the, uh, the thing, so you cannot actually move it. Okay, so this is uh, manufactured by Tisha, the bit at the bottom here, and you're looking in this case here uh, with everything to do with 33,500. So I've given you a very appro much an approximation on cost there. Let's come up here. Now in the United States you see lots of these on the road. In Europe it's it considerably uh, less of them. In fact I've only actually been in one off a site and I had some neighbours parked next to me in Italy and I was in their camping pod and I'm using that as a word so I don't really know what the proper word for one of these things is. Uh, I was at a, a Slovenian company yesterday and manufacture them and we couldn't come to any agreement on what they're actually called. But anyway, never mind that because you can see there's plenty of room inside. It's a bit like a TARDIS. It looks smaller on the outside than it is by the time you get inside. And that is a full-size bed, really large. You've got here space around a table. We've got here a Dometic fridge. And here we've got, let's go into this room down here. Now see how the door is uh, profiled, comes out, and you've got there toilet, shower, and the sink here will move up like that. Oh, sorry, in that direction, wrong direction. It moves up in that, that way. So, pretty large shower well-shaped door. I remember that one because it's, that's, that, that, that's very rather innovative in my opinion. And in here, more storage. And here, a bit of hanging space. And you can keep your dog food down here because your dog will want somewhere something to eat. And under your dog food, you've got your boiler and your heating. So, that's how it all works. Here we've got your kitchen, and you can do your prep over there. Sink. And three burner hobs. So, in German, it's called pickup cabin. And there you control your temperature and all the rest of it. So it's compact. It's relatively easy to park. Horses for courses, as we see. Is this the sort of thing you might want? Well, you can let me know. And I'll show you some more of the fantastic stuff we've got here at Caravan Salon in Dusseldorf.